Clergy members in Queens bless a beloved statue that was vandalized over the summer. As Christy Kalishian reports, this is not the first time that church was targeted. Blessings by Bishop Robert Brennan for the 42 year old statue of baby Jesus that's now fully intact and in its original spot between Mary and Joseph outside of Holy Family Roman Catholic Church in Fresh Meadows, Queens. The statue's restored, our faith is restored again. At around 5 a.m. on June 30th, a man can be seen stopping his taxi across the street from the church, then striking the baby Jesus statue multiple times, leaving it headless. Police say the man who did this was eventually arrested, 44-year-old Jamshaid Chowdhury, and charged with multiple counts of a hate crime and criminal mischief. What happened here is kind of small when you look at so many who are suffering for their faith here and around the world in so many ways as you see so many attacks on religion and violence and all of that. Holy Family Roman Catholic Church was targeted in another attack over a year before in late March of last year. Teens believed to be 15 to 17 years old were seen on surveillance video removing an angel statue from behind a fence then throwing it on the ground. That statue was not replaced and those teens were later arrested but released. It gets tiring when this happens to us, but uh, we're not going to let us ruin our faith. We're going to keep coming back and we're not going to remove the statue. We're not going to start hiding statues. No, this is our property and we're proud of our faith. The church has since installed more fencing and surveillance cameras. Although these attacks didn't happen while school was in session at Holy Family Catholic Academy, it compromised eighth grader Isabella Rivera's peace of mind. So my school's right there, so it was a little frightening that someone would do that to like such a beautiful statue, even to people that would harm no one. But as Bishop Brennan said at Sunday's Mass, fear not. Well, you know, the scriptures that were given to us today came from the prophecy Isaiah. He said, say to those who are frightened, fear not. Be strong. Your God is here to save you. And that statue says it so eloquently, but we say it to one another. The pastor with a message to those who've targeted the church. We want to hold you accountable, right? We want justice served, but also we do forgive you. We are in the business of forgiving, and we hope and pray that whatever he's going through, uh, that he finds peace in his own heart and his own life. As for the man accused of vandalizing the Jesus statue, he's expected to be in court at a later date. In Fresh Meadows, Queens, Christy Kalishian, CBS News, New York.